Okay, in this video, I'm going to show you guys how to use our player controls. So in our video window, you see we've got a number of player controls here. And uh, the middle one is our play pause. And we have keyboard shortcuts for all of these. So as I go through them, I'm going to tell you what the keyboard shortcuts are. So we've got our play pause button and the space bar is the uh, keyboard shortcut for that. We've got our slow motion forward button, which is the B key, B as in boy. We've got the slow motion backwards key, which is the V key as in Victor. We've got a fast forward button, which is the N key. We've got a rewind button, which is the C key. We've got a step forward five seconds button, which is the M key, M is in mom. We've got a step backwards five seconds button, which is the X key. And then we have our next play and previous play, which is the, uh, the right arrow key and the left arrow key. We've got a switch angle button here. If you've got a dual angle uh, game, an intricate game with the sideline and an end zone, uh, this switches back and forth. And the Z key is the next angle. And also in the controls here, you've got your time bar. And this time bar, you can grab it and you can scrub back and forth to see frame by frame action. You've also got uh, an auto play button here. And when this is on, it'll automatically play um, to the next play. And continuing down the list, um, if you turn it off, it'll stop at the end of the play. So you can replay it over and over again. This feature right here, again, pertains to dual angle games. So if you have just one angle, when it's in single angle, it's just going to continually play um, from one play to the next in the angle that it's on. If you switch it to intercut mode, it will then play sideline end zone, sideline end zone. Now, along with our keyboard shortcuts, you can utilize a, a remote control. And the remote control that I'm recommending to most everybody is the Logitech Wireless Gamepad F710. And what's great about this is it's a great piece of hardware. Logitech's a great company. It's a really great price. So if you go to Amazon, you can order it for you know roughly uh, 45 bucks here and have it delivered within a day or two. And what's great about these remotes is that they're programmable. So uh, you can use this on your Mac or PC and then program our keyboard shortcuts for all the different buttons here exactly the way that you want it. Um, and using this is really great because you can customize it and you don't have to spend two, three hundred bucks on a cowboy remote. That's a proprietary piece of uh, hardware. Uh, and so with this, it's great. It's really affordable and you can customize it the way you want uh, with our uh, player controls and our keyboard shortcuts. So in the next couple of videos, I'm going to talk about how you can configure uh, your remote control on a PC and also on a Mac.